deadlifts. Okay, I'm gonna use the big bar. Not all of y'all have a seven foot bar, but that's what I got going on right now. My other bar is too heavy. <laughs> so if you do a deadlift with the barbell, you'd have plates on it, right? So it would be a little bit taller. If you're doing a conventional deadlift, a stiff leg deadlift, anything but a sumo deadlift, your feet are about hip width apart, okay? Maybe a little bit wider. Toes out just slightly. We want this line from the hips all the way down because it's the most stable. So with that nice line, I'm gonna go side on actually, now that you've seen my feet. You're going to pick the bar up. I'm not like this. I'm also not in this really deep squat. I'm gonna come down. This kind of depends on hamstring flexibility, right? But if you're fairly flexible in your hammies and it's stiff leg dead, you could have nice long legs, otherwise a little knee bend. You can grip with a mixed grip, which is one hand under, one hand over. Your preference, people naturally have one. You can grip underhand, you can grip overhand, everyone's different. For me, when my weights get heavier on the bar, I like a mixed grip. So I've got my mixed grip. I'm gonna pull the bar really close to my shins. I'm gonna look forward, it would be about here, right, with bar, but with uh, plates on it. And then we're gonna come up. Things I'm not doing. I'm not letting the bar go far away from me as I come down and up. The bar is right close, almost like I'm shaving my legs on the way down. It's actually touching my shin bones. And then I'm coming up. You don't need to go all the way to the floor. We wanna keep the glutes and the hamstrings engaged. Right here, they stop engaging anyway. Right, you've got this hinge thing, a lot of instability in the lower back. So take your deadlift right about to the edge and come back up. Don't let the hips rise first. On deadlifts, I want you to think leg press at the bottom of the deadlift and similar to a hip thrust at the top. So we're pushing with the legs, feeling that length and strength of the back of the body as we draw the bar up, keeping it close to us, engaging the glutes, the hamstrings, not using the lower back. For upper body positioning, make sure you don't roll and round forward. Take your body up, take it back, keep this position while you do your deadlift, okay? I know I've got a crop to talk on, but you want everything nice, strong, secure. When you start to go into these heavier deadlifts using the barbell, it's very important that you're aware of where your lower back is and all these good things, okay?